Hey, what's going on everyone? A lot of you guys have asked me about um, Magic Bold Looks 2.0 and about saving your work, making presets, and how in the last version you were able to save your work as a .ls3 file like this in the Magic Bold Looks Builder. And then you would be able to import that file into Magic Bold Looks Filter onto your onto your clip that you wanted to color correct and you guys have noticed in the new one that you can't import your already saved presets from the last spot from the last version and you can't make any so but you are able to save your work just not in that same way um, when this is just going to show you guys real quickly alright once you are in magic bolt looks and once you have done your color correction Alright, I'm not going to get too big on color correction because a lot of you know how to use it. Um, for those of you who, some of you have asked about using it, if you've had the last version, there's not much, I mean, it looks different, but everything is still basically the same. Um, you still have most of your, the same options. They give you some new options, but basically it's all still the same, so I'm not going to get too much into making color corrections because there are people who do who have already done color correction tutorials. I'm just showing you guys how to save your work after you do the color correction. So once you're completely finished with your clip, all right, you're going to make sure the looks is highlighted and you're gonna to go to animation, save animation preset and just make it magic bullet looks new CC and we're just going to save it. Okay. And that'll actually save your preset, your work, from the Magic Bullet Looks Builder. As soon as it. There we go. Alright, now to show you guys that it does work like that, I deleted the color correction I did. Then I'm going to go to Apply Animation Preset. Here's the one that we. that I just saved. And there you go. It, there's the one, there's the color correction that I just did in the new looks builder. So you are able to save your presets, just not in the old fashion of going to file and, you know, save as and, you know, import at, import blah blah blah. So that's just what you guys are going to have to do from now on. So just like I said, make sure looks is highlighted, animation, save animation preset, and then just save it. And then all you have to do is apply animation preset and just find the one what you just did. Um, to not get yourself confused with other presets that you guys save, I'll just label it Magic Bullet Looks and then whatever CC you want to call it. So that's all there really is to it, guys, plain and simple. So I hope this helps you guys out a bit so that you guys can save your presets instead of having to redo them all the time. Later.